now KLBK's first warning weather with meteorologist Jack Maney. As we bring in this Tuesday, we are going to continue to see some gusty winds this afternoon, but it's going to be just a little bit less intense than it was out there yesterday. And this morning, we're already seeing a little bit of wind from our tower cam shot. You can see that camera getting jostled around just a tiny bit by those gusty winds that we have out there this morning. But this time of the morning, we're usually seeing calmer winds, but right now still 15 miles per hour out of the west with a temperature at 38 degrees. We did have a cold front roll through yesterday, so our temperatures are a little cooler this morning than they were yesterday. 38 here in the Hub City. A couple spots trying to make it down to freezing there in Mule Shoe, 32 degrees, 33 up in Friona, elsewhere mostly mid 40s, with 46 for Turkey, 40, 41 degrees there in Matador, 44 degrees for Jayton, and 38 degrees down in the city of Snyder, 39 in La Mesa to start out your Tuesday morning. That coupled with those wind gusts around 20 to 25, maybe even a couple spots reaching a 30 mile per hour gust this morning. Those t wind chill values feeling more like 29 outside here in Hub City, 27 up in Mule Shoe, and mid lower to middle 30s out towards the east. So definitely going to want to take your jackets with you as you head out the door this morning, keeping our skies more on the clear side with just a few passing clouds, especially to the south of the Hub City this morning. That'll probably give us a pretty nice sunrise once the sun comes up here in about another hour and a half or so and that storm system that brought us the strong winds yesterday now pulling towards the east that produced a pretty a pretty big severe weather event down there in the deep south yesterday as that continues to move on off towards the east our winds are going to continue to get lighter but still there is some jet stream energy moving overhead today and that will translate to more gusty winds out of the west at 22 to 28 miles per hour this afternoon especially once we get those once we get the sun to come up we'll start to tap into those winds higher up in the atmosphere and that'll bring those stronger winds right around 10 to 11 o'clock this morning. 56 degrees are high temperature skies, mostly sunny to occasionally completely clear and temperatures a little cooler out towards the north and west. Might even struggle to make it to 50 degrees out in Clovis this afternoon, but the rest of us should make it to the middle 50s and some low 60s out towards the east. 62 in Jayton, 63 for Guthrie, 61 in Post and 57 for Rawls is high temperature this afternoon. Those winds are going to be pretty gusty and they'll peak right around 10 or 11 o'clock this morning with some gusts around 30, 35, maybe a few 40 mile per hour gusts, but not quite as bad as it was out there yesterday. Not quite as widespread either with those strong winds. Then those will taper off after sunset. Another fairly breezy night overnight tomorrow. And then it looks like tomorrow afternoon, another fairly gusty wind event comes up, but it is going to be short lived throughout the afternoon. Wind gusts generally falling to around 25 miles per hour and we'll continue that downward trend with our wind speeds as that storm system continues to pull further and further away. High pressure by the end of this week will be giving us a little bit of a warm up Thursday and into Friday. Another passing storm system. This one quite a bit weaker will bring in a weak cold front over the weekend, but I don't think we're going to be having much in the way of major cool downs anytime soon. The Arctic air is going to be locked up in Canada. The jet stream staying pretty far to the south and that's going to continue to promote windy conditions for us, but really not going to have much in the way of extremely cold weather, at least for the foreseeable future and as such our first snow contest continues to run we still have not had our first snowfall of the year and you can still get your guesses in for when that might be and you could win free Bahama Bucks for an entire year if you can guess when our first snowfall of at least one inch will be officially here in Lubbock now there's your forecast for the coming week 56 degrees today a little bit breezy but those winds will come down quite a bit by the end of this week Thursday looking real nice 62 degrees southwest winds just 10 to 15 miles per hour bright sunshine and then how about 70 degrees for your high on Friday. The cool front coming in on Saturday will bring, bring us back down into the upper 50s. All right, love it. Thank you so much, Jack. Still to come on Brian.